I am Sir Tap Tap. This is Dweller's Empty Path by Temi Chang. Last time we left off, um, there's a weird, creepy demon dude stalking us and like putting nightmares in our head, and everything in the forest wants to vor us. So that's unfortunate. To deliver today. Let's visit the uh, hole girl. It's Hatsune Miku. Oh, Yoki. You came to visit me. What a surprise. Oh, hello. Oh, it's Arm Gauntlet Girl! So there, uh, Temi made a little animation of these characters beforehand. Um, apparently it was her first thing put on Itch. I didn't know you could put animations on Itch. But yeah, if you want to check that out, it, um, it's just these three witch question mark girls fighting a dragon. It's pretty cool. It's a little three minute animation that uh, I don't think is exactly... It's just that it was kind of like alternate universe to what happens here. But uh, if you enjoyed Temi's stuff, I'd definitely check it out. Um, remind me to put a link in the comments or something. A, a model? A model. Hello. You are small. I see you're in the middle of repairs right now. Yeah, I've been doing it all day. Did you damage your arm? What happened? I got into a fight with the beast type earlier. Not really sure what I did to upset her. I don't think I did anything usual, just minding my own business. Next thing I know, she charged right at me and tore through my arm. My mechanical arm got damaged a bit. It's nothing the beast mechanic, the best mechanic, and the whole kingdom can't fix. Seeing Claire's potions won't work on you, otherwise I'd go grab one for you. Ugh, even if they did work on me, there's no way I'd take it. I like her, she threw on poison just to spite me. Whoa! I don't think she'd go that far. Maybe she would. Whoa, what? There's some animosity here. I bet she would. I bet it was her that had agitated the beast type to attack me. Next time I see her, I'll give her a piece of my mind. I really don't think she would upset the beast type. You don't want to agitate the beast type, don't you think it'd be Zara? Oh. I guess so. I've been seeing him around here more lately, huh? Maybe you should give him a punchy piece of your mind instead. No way. Zara's really scary. Tell me about it. I have all the energy from earlier. <laughs> I definitely get Tabby vibes from the music. Surprise. Temi makes made all of this, by the way. It's a single person project. Um, do you really think Zara would have agitated that beast type? If it was anyone to be him, right? Maybe. But why do you do that? He only ever focuses on you. I guess you're right. So if it wasn't Zara. It was definitely Claire! Just looking for a reason to blame Claire, huh? Or if it really was Zara. Beast types have been unusually active lately. This is like a man off of various machinery. Did you read that bright as herself? Oh, it's a bed. The bed is hard as rock. Also, the charging cable attached to it. Aww. So she's like mechanical. The photo of me, Claire, and Emma. The scribbles drawn under Claire's face. The lamp is on. I guess even though it's sunny out, there's no windows down here. Why does why does she live in a hole? Aren't these vegetables from my garden? Looks as though look like spare parts. I guess her mechanical arm needs lots of maintenance. All right. So those are the three six sisters. I guess I was supposed to go there earlier, but oh well. You know what, hint bird? Let's see how this works. Have you helped the lost travel find his way? Lost travel, huh? No mail today. Zara's gone. It's something ominous about the darkness of our roof. I don't think it's supposed to be ominous, but it kind of looks like that one. Oh, I should have gone here first. Oh! There's a little cutscene. There's the kingdom in the distance, there's a little house. Neat! I'm a big sucker for, uh, for graphics like this. And cutscenes and stuff, you know, and, you know, full screen illustrations. Uh, lots of games will do this kind of art style, you know. Even specifically Game Boy, Super Nintendo, NES style. But they don't do, like, full screen graphics and stuff. Which was pretty often a thing, like, at least for title screens and stuff. Like, I talked about this in uh, Counter Spy. Counter Spy had a lot of um, animated cutscenes that are like, you know, DOS games would have that kind of stuff. I'm gonna pause for just a sec so we get to where we need to go. Obviously, I need to find something. Ah, this is probably our lost traveler. It's strange, no matter how far I walk. It's like I'm going around in circles. Rumor has it this forest has been enchanted by a witch. All who enter the forest lose their way. Yes, the rumors are true. I'm lost too. 
guess he's talking about Claire's barrier. Barrier only activates if strangers get too close to our house, though. Barrier should be broken at the moment. It's still in effect to make people lose their way. Are you not affected by the enchanted forest? Do you think you can help me out of here? I'm looking for the nearby village. Yeah, let's help him out. Okay, I'm trying to stray too far from me. It must be this way because this is not the way we came. What a peaceful, lovely little forest with the poogles. This boar seems a little mean. Oh, it's a that's a boar, not a poogle. Sparkles! Huh? How did my journal end up here? Should I record stuff? <laughs> that's my journal? Okay. My, my, my journal is magic. I was wondering how it would handle the save point since my journal is at home. Huh. Fairly big map. I'm surprised by that. Dwell it. Miss, where'd you go? Hello? Guess this is Zara's doing. He probably doesn't want any visitors. Let's get a spooky cat maid. It's always a pleasure to see you again, Miss Yoki. It's always a place for you here. Alright, I feel like we should check this out later. It's a big... Oh. Oh. Big... It's a it's a bigger game. Um, we gotta kind of stay focused. So I wonder if... What's down here? Cow! Oh, I love cows. There's a cow. Um, Alright. Let's just help this guy out first, and then we'll, we'll see up what's up with Zara's stupid house. It's a strange fog, and I say I know I was back here. I just feel like there should be a map. It doesn't seem that big, though. It doesn't seem too big to require a map. I made a guide for the last game. I, I might be too late to do that this time. There might already be stuff out there. I don't know. Doggo. How? What a cute wolf. Wolves are not <laughs> cute. Stay away from wolves. What the? Edgy people. Are you guys lost? You're pretty deep in the forest. Nope. We're doing just fine. You sure? Be far from anywhere. Yep. Other furries. Strange. Can't sense a fountain anywhere. Fountain. Interesting. We'll definitely be meeting up with those people later. Are we not beast people? Because I got like a tail and bunny ears too. But I don't seem to vor people. At least I hope not. Tree stump! Someone's been here recently. A peculiar tree stump. Surely some might come this by here often. Yeah, I know somebody who does. Someone who likes to come up here and spar with me once in a while. Interesting. It's so funny how, like, that, that, that just brings me straight to, like, 90s anime, where everybody is, like, the, the relationship is, yes, we are best friends, we beat the crap out of each other constantly. That's, that's, that's how we express our friendship. <gasps> Mr. Mole! Ah, uh, it ran away. Mr. Mole. I'm so glad we met. Though our time was fleeting, you left a deep impact on my life. All right, we can't see. We can't go this way. So I think it's down. What a gloomy little spook forest this part is. All right, so it must be down here. Also, I'm surprised this isn't just the normal walking speed. I'm holding shift constantly, which is kind of uncomfortable. I would have just left this as the normal walking speed, you know, just just be, make fast the normal speed. Moo. What's a cow doing this deep in the forest? Yeah, how strange. I was hoping the cow indicated we are getting close to the uh, town, but perhaps not. Wolves versus fox! This looks a little rough. Let's turn around. I agree. <laughs> Pokemon battle. It's a it's a it's a horde encounter. These little deer seems hungry. <laughs> I like how he comments on the animals, but I don't. Oh, here we go. This sure is a sign I can't read from over here. It's village Castle Town. Let's go to Hyrule Castle Town. What are these? Found missing journal pages. What? What do you mean missing journal pages? Can, can I read those at home? I guess. Bun. Bun. How cute. The bunny wants to play. Aww. 
Alright, let's take this loser back to town. Warning, beast type territory ahead. Good thing we didn't run into any beast types. I've been gone for sure. Are you weak to beast type? Yeah, you were really lucky. You're being affected by the barriers for the best. Why'd you even go in? I like how just much stuff there is. There's a frog! South Village. Ah, this'll be fine. Thank you so much for helping me out of the forest. Sure thing. Bye. I wonder how we got so deep in the forest. Did you not notice any of the signs? I wonder if Zara had anything to do with it. We'll talk to Zara in a bit. Bark, bark, bark. How did my journal end up here? <laughs> my, my journal is everywhere. It fills me with determination, fortunately. Are you a beast type? My mommy told me to stay away from you. She said you're actually a scary beast type in disguise. I was... I was a little wondering about that. But no, I'm not into Vor. Don't worry, I don't do that. Oh well. The villagers like to make wishes at this one. I wonder if any of them come true. Maybe we should try it. Oh, I can't wish. I hope it's better than like wish.com, because that place sucks ass. I don't have anything to deliver at the moment. Are you all animal people too? <laughs> I like how only the head, only the top half of the head moves. I just moved here from Castletown, it's a bit of a distance from here. I need for some things to appear in the mail, to arrive in the mail my family's sending over. They sure are taking their time. The boxes here, because they moved in recently. So I've been writing several letters. I feel like I shouldn't look through other people's fridges. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, so we're all animal people, so what makes a beast type a beast type? Just the vor thing? Oh, it's the delivery girl. You've been doing a great job. Before you used to deliver the mail, it was Este, but we'd always get our mail at weird hours. It would be several days late. So much better now that you deliver everything. Thank you. I think he tries his best, though. How spacey Este can be. I can't imagine how anyone ever got their mail. Some people drop off their mail here. I don't have to look through it right now. Oh. Hello. Hey, boss. Bat boss. Oh, she's got uh, heterochromic eyes. Hey, Esther! Oh, hello. Sorry. I wasn't paying attention. I didn't notice you walked in. No worries, I'm a bit out of it myself. Though, he's always like this. Hey, now that you're here, there's some mail that's been piling up. Can you get around to sending them out? Uh, not actually. I didn't come here for work. Yeah, sure thing. I'm not scheduled today, though. I'll still get paid, right? Hey, he's zoned out again. The letters for you to send out over today are on the table. So these are letters sent out today. Let's to those deliver these. Letter delivery quest start! Great. What's this? So we have the letter delivery quests. If you walk west, you'll head to the kingdom's border. I've never gone that far. Here's what the kingdom next over is. Let's travel out again soon, though. The prince throws a fit if he finds out I leave. It's too faded to read. Oh, it's a dragon shrine! Large dragon statue. You can cover in moss and vines. Oh, jeez, this really is expansive, huh? Alright, we probably shouldn't go all the way out this way. What's up, bird? Chirp, chirp. Are you feeling lost? Confused? Why not take a carriage ride and find the carriage service of the village of the tassel gate? Alright. We're gonna see what's in the dragon shrine, and we'll call this an episode. What? Spooky. Oh, but there's a legendary Pokemon in here, but you gotta come back with like a special item you can only get after the Elite Four. That's always how that works. A large dragon st statue. It's falling apart. Guess nobody comes by to take care of it. A statue of a forgotten deity of some sort. It's been here for as long as I remember. If you've ever actually seen anyone come here talk about it. I wonder what the statue's all about. Mm -hmm. 
music's going places, though. I feel sorry for the dragon place. Well, <gasps> oops. Mr. Mr. Ponytail, c come back. Who was that? Who was that? All right, we're not gonna wander too far in the other place because the map does seem fairly large. So I don't wanna waste too much time, but when we come back, we will uh, talk to the villagers more and try to deliver all this mail out and see what's going on here. And apparently we got a something with a carriage. I don't know what that's about yet. <laughs>